after a long tiring day of work and travel what kind of space would you like to come home to a vacation home this is exactly what this is hi i'm preetu mulle pande and i'm a senior interior designer at live space This is one of my most favorite projects and you will soon find out why. The inspiration comes from the briefing received from the client. First thing she wanted is a state of art home. Second, easy on maintenance and third, child friendly. She has a very cute little toddler in the house. The space here when we first came was completely a bare shell. We have uh, moved walls, modified the room spaces, combined bedrooms to give them this house. My clients are every designer's dream. They love clean lines and they let me experiment to make the most of each space. This house is our take on the contemporary concept, but focus is on form and function. Take a look at these visually light slate grey sofas. These C-shaped corner tables were born from the desire to create something very convenient for people sitting on the long end of the sofas. The magnanimous coffee table is from one piece of wood and its free flowing reaches out to every corner of the seating. The unit of the background is a union of three different materials. marble wood and brass but all in a very subtle monotone the dining table actually took the longest to pick we saw 100 marbles to pick the final marble top and we stumbled upon this beautiful piece it has shades of brown and pops of mint which is so rare to find in a marble So we decided to splash that mint onto the chairs. The four leather chairs are embedded with brass handles which are very functional and very chic. Moving on to the lights, so it was very important to pick the right language of chandeliers here, the right family of chandeliers here because we didn't want it to be too glamorous. So uh, this is something bespoke and very luxe. the brass and the slight bling from the dining area moves on and carries forward to the consoles which are bespoke the brass is woven on to the drawer fronts and the knobs are hand picked very specifically to suit the playfulness of the space and of course the little one loves animals the master bedroom is pure romance We've used a deep hues, rich textures, and irresistible seating areas. This room is actually the perfect example of living larger than life, but very humbly, very rooted. So, be it this four-poster bed, which is gigantic, it's seven feet by eight feet to accommodate the child as well. The turquoise vela here. and this set of trunks is actually a chest of drawers handcrafted in leather there's a partition in the middle of the bedroom which divides it into two spaces so the tv is inside it it is flexible and it can be moved to both sides and viewed in both sides You know the husband likes to watch football matches which you know are aired only in the night so uh, the wife doesn't get disturbed that way These wardrobes are my favorite part of the room this pastel pop in matte forms a perfect backdrop to this multi-dimensional seating area It's a fun colorful area for you know close friends to come over On the other hand is the desk which is very serene it's completely done in satpario marble 
with drawer storage with enough storage for a printer and of course their stash of books. The client did not want the guest room just to be for guests so it doubles up as a TV room. That's why we decided to make it very elegant and cozy. As you can see here, we've used the gramophone with a modern twist to create the mood for movies. This room is an osmosis of pastel colors and deep hues. You can see it here in the background wallpaper designed by Sabisachi himself. Need I say more? People tend to spend a lot of time in the kitchen without realizing it. That's why it's one of the most neglected spaces in the house. But this one has been designed for good vibes only. This is where the family comes together, bonds over meals, fresh off the flame. It's like a dream come true, right? Modular kitchen profile shutters are timelessly versatile, so why they're looking vintage adorned with these ornate red knobs, they blend in perfectly with the rest of the contemporary mood of the house. Let's peek into the room that makes every adult yearn to be a child again. The wall here is not just a visual treat, it's a visual stimuli. It's holding out little knobs that have interactive games. This along with the gymnast tropes encourages a child to be taller. The toy storage is consciously made accessible for a child, making him more independent and responsible. The flooring here looks like wooden flooring, right? It's actually rubber flooring, hence heavily cushioned. Don't you want to be a child again? Carrying forward from the playroom, the child's room is full of fun and colour. So starting from the headboards to this animated set of drawers and a pull-out bed for his friends to sleep over. We have wardrobes with concealed handles to ensure the child's safety. The black band you see unifies the whole room by adding a new flavour to it. It then continues to become this horizontal ledge to park his toys without actually blocking the window. Every space has its utility, it has a function. The most exciting part of this project was that the client um, gave me complete independence to do whatever I liked with it. Like this video? Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe for new home tours, interior ideas and more every week.